you think Frances Hall lost it? I think she reached the boiling point, absolutely. I think she was dealing with the fact that she knew her husband had embarrassed her. And then this mistress obviously was extremely disrespectful. And seeing it in her own eyes, we see this all the time. You just reach a boiling point, and she did. She reacted instead of responded. If she would have responded with a phone call, a text, cuss them out, do whatever you want to do, make the decision to divorce, all that's fine. But what she decided to do is she reacted and turned her car around, catching up to them, started using her car as a weapon, committed an aggravated assault with a deadly weapon. And based on the evidence, I want your reaction to what Francis Hall said to me. We had a chance to interview her in jail. Mm -hmm. I never, ever touched her vehicle. I never would have hurt Bill. And she's sobbing as she tells me this. If I had a chance to talk with her, I would say, then why did you turn your vehicle around and follow them? And her response would be to talk to them. And I would say, ma'am, that just doesn't make sense. Do you have any doubt in your mind that she wanted to do physical harm that day? I have no doubt in my mind that she committed an aggravated assault with the potential of physical harm. If I, if I hold a knife to your throat, but I do not cut you, that's still aggravated assault with a deadly weapon in Texas. If I hold a weapon, a gun to your head, but do not pull the trigger, that's still aggravated assault with a deadly weapon in Texas. And if you drive at a high rate of speed, speed and, and you start hitting vehicle, somebody in the back, it would still be what? aggravated assault with a deadly weapon. What should Francis have done in this circumstance? You're asking me my opinion? Divorce him. Leave him. Let them be happy or miserable together, but not affect her life and her family's life. And, and whether, regardless of the culpability of Mr. Hall from a morality and, and commitment standpoint, I mean, he shouldn't have lost his life over this.